Hi traders, Roberto here. This is the tutorial for the FX Agency Advisory 3 slash price action. So essentially what we're doing is looking for trade setups using this advisory indicator and confirming it with price action. Let me just show you a few trades that were taken. The first one was the Euro USD. When we're in an uptrend and price came back down to support and then gave us an alert at the top of the hour and initially we had a color change candle so that was the first alert so I'd know that this retracement is complete and we're looking for buying opportunities and once it broke that level of resistance then we were able to take this trade where right where this green arrow is that was the first trade now we're looking at a level of resistance but um, I would hesitate to take this trade and because we don't see any red candles yet so using price action our one hour scalp system and combining this with the FX agency advisory 3 we have plenty of tools to be able to take a trade um, the other pair was Aussie yen now Aussie yen is a very user-friendly or easy currency to trade especially if you're using these indicators and there were so many trades in the past few days selling and buying the market trended quite well and yesterday we had a nice sell um, opportunity up here where we there was a color change candle initially then it turned into an evening star and the FX advisory 3 indicator gave us a sell alert so not only did we have a color change candle, an evening star, but it was at a sell zone. So that was an easy trade to take. And the market came back down to a support level. The advisory indicator gave us a, a buy alert. And we have a color change candle. We have a hammer. And so this was an easy trade to take. Now it's getting, it looks like we're getting set up, set up for a uh, sell opportunity. And it hasn't qualified yet on the candlestick patterns because this candle has yet to close so I need confirmation that this will turn around and head south but I would wait for this candle to close and then see if the next candle penetrates a pit below the close of this red candle and since this candle is not even finished yet um, this can turn you know it's about right now it's 830 and this candle is going to close and a half an hour and that candle can turn from red to green so I'm going to wait till the top of the hour and see what happens and possibly take a trade I'm looking at the Aussie dollar I notice price came was we've been in, a, in an uptrend the past few days the panel was telling me that the daily the four hour one hour and 30 minute chart all in an uptrend so all I need to do is wait for the market to um, retrace, gave us a buy alert. So we have a hammer, we have color change candle. So that was an easy trade to take using the combination of candlestick patterns and the FX Agency Advisory 3 alert. Now we're in a um, resistance level. The indicator is giving us a sell signal, but of course, um, I need more confirmation. I need for a candle to turn red and then um, either an inside bar reversal candle. We're looking at a one hour chart so hopefully that will happen. It's still too early to tell because it's only 8.30 in the morning Eastern and this candle is yet to close. So um, and I hesitate to take any uh, reversal candles uh, trade setups when the New York session is, is still open. Um, if this would occur around after the New York session wind it down like a 12 or 1 o'clock in the afternoon Eastern, that would be a better trade setup. So let's we're gonna wait and see what happens. And if this candle does close, then yes we would take a trade. The close is red I mean. So that concludes this tutorial. If you have any questions or if you'd like to purchase the 
FX Agency indicator. There's a link below this video. Have a good trading uh, day. What's left of it tomorrow's long farm payroll. I will be sending out um, trade recommendations to our subscribers. Thanks again. Have a good weekend. Talk to you guys soon.